Hi guys, I'm about to go do an interview with Anthony Padilla. My allergies are It's nothing contagious. I just get really bad allergies sometimes, like my lupus acts up. So today's not the best day to do an interview. I've looked worse for sure. Um, but they had to reschedule a few times and like I just didn't want to be the reason why they reschedule again. So we're gonna do this and we're gonna kill it and I'm not gonna be awkward. Speaking my goals into existence. I'm gonna bring my camera along with me. Probably won't vlog inside there or like around because I'm not trying to like dox them. But here's my vlog. I'm doing something outside of sex work. Isn't that cool? Even though I'm talking about sex work. <laughs> Guys, I feel like I did so good. Okay, so before I called my dad and he gave me a little pep talk, and so I was so nervous about doing this interview that I represented cam girls correctly, but also myself correctly and all these things. I feel like I did so good. I feel like it's gonna turn out so good. I'm so excited for you guys to see this. I always feel so proud of myself and accomplished once I do things that scare me and I don't let my anxiety win. And today I didn't let my anxiety win. I definitely had a few anxiety attacks before and like maybe a little during, but I'm really proud of myself for doing something that made me so anxious and I think that you guys can do stuff like this too. And I think that you guys should also be trying to do things that make you feel anxious because we can only grow through being uncomfortable and I'm proud of myself today. So guys, so like I was saying, I'm really happy that I went through and I did this because there was definitely times where I was going to let my anxiety win and be like, no, I can't do it. I can't talk to someone for an hour on camera. But honestly, I think it's so important to push through things that make you uncomfortable. That's the only way that we grow and I feel so good right now. I would feel much worse if I had just let my anxiety win and not did it. Um, so yeah, it was a very good experience. I feel like you guys probably want to know what the experience was like. Um, the two other girls that are doing it are Sabina Rouge and Lena the Plug, which I think will be really good. They've both done professional porn type stuff and cam, so I think it'll be very interesting to hear like their version of it and their experience, so I'm excited for that. I'm excited that I got to be involved with something like this. You have Lena, who is extremely successful, so she can talk about like reaching extreme success with cam then you have sabina i don't know much about her but like she's very beautiful i've heard that she works so hard so that will be very interesting to hear her perspective and there's me and so i'm definitely the least popular person on this episode but i'm really excited that i got to do it this can be a little car vlog thing i'll tell you guys a little bit about the experience if you want to know so basically i got there and i parked and his pa i believe came out she was like the sweetest girl like she was so pretty and sweet and it made me feel really comfortable like everyone on his team was so nice during the interview i was nervous that like what i was saying was stupid but they kept laughing so like even if they were laughing at me and no, i'm just kidding um but it made me feel really comfortable because you could tell that it was like a good work environment i feel really uncomfortable if everything was like super professional i feel like they have a good team that gets along and he was so nice to everyone so it wasn't like an uncomfortable atmosphere um the interview went good the interview was an hour long but they only cut that into like 20 minute videos and so it kind of sucks that like not everything will get shown but i mean you guys have me on youtube i've probably talked about the same things that i was going to talk about this is my first non-sex work interview i definitely didn't really look or feel my best today but i did it and i did it i'm excited i'm so excited as you can see i don't usually do interviews outside of sex work so i'm like hyped right now he gave me this shirt i'm actually gonna make it into a crop top oh my god we print our merch on the same kind this is the same brand that i print this stuff on <laughs> it says i was gonna ask him if he wanted to be in my vlog for a minute but i also didn't want to like make him work or like ask him to do anything which he probably would have because he was so nice but i'm sorry like you'll just have to watch his video which is going to be linked below because i'm waiting to post this until they post theirs um and yeah it was a super good experience like i have no complaints no one made me feel weird i hope that they edit me to make me look really cool because i'm a really awkward person but that's about it that's my little rant on being on the anthony padilla show and i'm really excited i hope that you guys love it i hope that um i don't get attacked by the internet <laughs>
I'm probably just gonna post this little mini vlog little rant about it and yeah I hope that you guys enjoyed this video definitely subscribe let me know what you want to see from me I hope that some people found my youtube channel because of the video and I'm excited to have you here so I will see you guys in the next video bye